So, I mean, it's, it's, it's maybe hard for me to point out, but I think, you know, growing up in a, in a house where, you know, you had um, such exposure to business definitely helps a lot. There's no doubt about that. Uh, and, the, you know, the two things I've learned from my dad, of course, are focus and discipline. That's something that he keeps, um, you know, we keep talking about daily, no problem. But um, more importantly, I've always been a very curious person since a very young age. And uh, I always try to figure out how things work and why things are the, are the way they are. And uh, when you start asking these questions, you understand that a lot of the things around you um, that are built, that are accepted, are actually not the best things. And, uh, and you know, I have, I've had this mindset all my life. And with my first startup, AppSpark, I got a hint of how you can go change that. How you can write, you know, small snippets of code and build a simple application like a movies now or a food store and have an impact and change maybe 100K, 200K people's lives. And once I got a knack of that, once I got a, you know, a, a bite of that, there's no turning back. And when you know you can change um, you know, things around you that, that, that you're dissatisfied with um, in a very sort of quick manner, fast manner, low cost manner, uh, it's something that attracts me a lot. Because I mean, I wanna live in a world where you have X, Y, Z, A, B, C. And there's a great quote by Alan Kay that talks about, you know, to predict the future, you got to build it yourself. You got to invent it, and I think that's what we're trying to do with BSB. The idea is, how do you make sort of the world a better place by you know building pervasive technology, uh, whether it might be through hike, hopper, or whatever new investments we make in BSB in the next three or five years, that just make lives a lot easier and better. And um, and I think that's a sort of mantra I follow for my personal life too. I think one of the things that uh, I was very certain about, you know, in my third, fourth year of college, you know, at least that late, was uh, my learning curve had to be very high, no matter what. Every six months, can I double myself as a person in my knowledge? And that requires a lot of hard work, but um, what, you, know, you end up coming to a point where based on all that, uh, based on all the growth, you can zoom out and see a, the bigger picture. And uh, that's something that uh, you know, I wanna sort of keep working on as sort of this you know, company builds, because I think uh, it's important to have that long-term vision when building something that's gonna impact, hopefully, you know, hundreds of millions, if not a billion people in this country. Wow. So I think that's, uh, that's how we think. Um, I know it keeps coming back to BSP, but um, I think, uh, you know, it's a long road ahead. Sure. Uh, we're, not gonna, we're, we're not sort of in this for the short term. Sure. Um, we're not looking to spin off companies. We're looking to build some, I, I don't like to say platforms, but we're, like, we're, we're sort of planning to build some very phenomenal consumer experiences mm. that can wow consumers mm. and that can become a part of their daily lives. That is very, very important. And doing the latter is very tough and you must understand every single consumer to go and do that. Yeah. The biggest problem in India right now is that a consumer who sits in the north in a, in a Delhi is very different from someone who's sitting in the south in a tier two city. And that's something that we are, you know, going to start spending a lot of time and effort into understanding. And that's the biggest challenge anyone's going to have. And so that's why I feel that, you know, even though you have a lot of West Coast companies coming in, which is a great thing, when you go further down the market, the diversity is so large that India becomes a bit like China and Japan. It's a bit of a, you know, um, empty space. Yeah, languages, you know, dialects, culture, content. If you look at telcos, they have a circle-based strategy and they have pricing points that are different, contents that, that's different. You know, the vast that's consumed in maybe a, a state like, you know, Karnataka is different to what gets consumed in Delhi. So you have to understand those patterns and behaviors and try to jump into that, you know, point where you can solve the problem. And, uh, you know, Hopper is a great example of this, where when you walk into a mall and market, let me sort of, you know, track back for a second, but when you wake up in the morning to when you sleep, you're sort of always at the intersection of decisions. And it might be a very small decision or a very large decision. Um, let's say, you know, you wake up in the morning, you know, what food to eat, what clothes to wear, what route to take to work. And there are services that can jump into each of these intersections and help you out. Google Maps and navigation is the best example. Uh, you know, I use it on a daily basis. And the same thing with Hopper is when you walk into a mall, and in India, this mall market culture has developed phenomenally in the last, uh, I think, three, four years, yeah. at least in the top eight cities, where you walk into a mall not knowing what you're gonna do because you have so much to do in the mall. So how do you jump into a person's life there and then and help them figure out what they wanna do? And so this is core to our philosophy across all our companies. 
Uh, and uh, I think that's the mindset that uh, we believe could help us build some very interesting stuff in this market. Sure. And who knows where this is going to go? At the end of the day, you know, Bharti SoftBank is a first of its, first of its kind for both companies. Mm. Uh, it's not something we've done before. Sure. Uh, so it's in a very exciting time. I'm, gonna, I'm having a lot of fun. Absolutely. And uh, fingers crossed, we'll see, you know, hopefully this sort of company itself become a very large sort of driving force in this market, helping change the ecosystem in India. Mm.